A1 is creating an environment that supports innovative solutions and new strategies to improve outcomes, embracing the role of nurses as leaders. Whatever I need, whether it's women's health oriented, neonatal nursing, obstetrics, I know I can go to A1 and get that information. We need to make a difference for our women and children and have healthy babies and healthy moms. And for us to do that, we need to have an active role in politics and legislative issues. And um, by coming together with A1, A1 supports the um, change. We are doing this for a reason, that we didn't just fall off a truck and decide one day to be maternal newborn nurses, that there's a reason that we're doing that. And sometimes when you're in the midst of policies, procedures, budgets, all those things that are a big part of the work that we have to do in healthcare today, you can lose sight of that. So that, that reminder of why we do what we do every day and um, I think that that's critical. Regardless of what's going on, when you step into that room, you are there for them. Because you never know what impact they're going to have. So you may be having a bad day, your kids may have got on your nerves, your, your, your partner may have said something that just like, ugh. But when you go to work and you're taking care of women and they're coming in and they're trusting their birth, labor and birth experience with you, you have to be there for them. And that's what Teresa did for me. She, she was there for me. The A1 2017 convention brings together nurses and leaders from around the globe, exchanging new ideas and solutions that help them provide the very best care to patients. As a OB nurse, you have to be a part of your association. It's what drives our practice, and we need to be informed and involved. Nurses have to be leaders. They're either leading other nurses or they're leading their patients and the patient's family to have a good outcome. If you had said 20 years before, five, five years before, are you gonna do it? And I'm like, no, are you crazy? No. And, it's, and I haven't re missed a day since then going, oh man, I wish I wasn't doing that. I wish I was doing something else. It's like, this is, it's so fulfilling to me. Uh, educationally, you know, which is A1's important with that, uh, spiritually, you know, emotionally, obviously, and also just mm, the camaraderie that I have with, other, with the other nurses. I mean, no disrespect to any other field of nursing, but I'm gonna tell you that maternal newborn nursing is the best field in nursing. In any given day, in one particular shift, this nurse can be an ICU nurse, a surgical nurse, a doula, a lactation consultant, a newborn nurse, uh, a counselor, a bereavement counselor. We do it all and we can do it all on a dime. I hope that bedside nurses participate more in nursing research. I think lots of nurses think that research is only for academicians, but nurses who do actual bedside frontline nursing can contribute to, um, to actual care practices by participating in research. This project was actually came straight from the nurses. All the interventions are nursing-based interventions that where nurses at the bedside are the ones who are assessing the, the newborn. It's extremely validating to the role of the nurse and how important we are in providing high-quality, evidence-based nursing practice. The goal for A1 is to energize and support nurses, translating knowledge into action that improves patient care. In New Orleans, I'm Dawn Ostrom.